Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome back again to Cosmic Culture, the channel where we talk about all major movie and television news. It's Chris, and DC has been working very hard this year to put their name back on the map as far as superhero movies are concerned. They've had a rough go of it, especially up against the MCU, and a lot of their connected timelines have been all over the map. But, thanks to DC Fandom, we have a lot more information about what direction Warner Brothers and DC are headed for the future of this franchise. And it all starts with this Flash movie. Now, we've gotten a lot of different reports about different characters who will be making their way into this Flash movie, and we'll recap that during this video, but the main purpose of this video is to talk about how Brandon Routh has said that the return of Superman for the Flash film is an absolute possibility. If you love to stay up to date on all of this major news as much as we do, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and turn on your notification bell so you don't miss out on any of this exciting news. Also, comment down below who else would you like to see join in this Flash movie? If it's connecting all of the parallel universes in the DC universe, who would you like to be involved in that? Now, we've heard a lot of big names pop up for returning in the Flash movie. For example, we know that Michael Keaton will be reprising his role as Batman in this movie, and it's been a few years, but we've even seen some concept art with Michael Keaton's Batman and The Flash together. We've also heard that Ben Affleck will be returning to reprise his role as Batman, even after he said that he was done with the character. And currently we are hearing rumors about Wonder Woman coming and Ray Fisher coming to reprise his role of Cyborg and many others who are hopefully going to be included in this movie. And the reason for that is that this Flash movie has such an important role in connecting all of the DC Universe as was explained during DC Fandom's Multiverse panel, where they went on to explain to us that all of the different parallel universes that exist in the DC Universe, which comprises of every movie show, all of it has the ability to be connected through these parallel universes, and the Flash movie is where all of these movies will bottleneck together. Now this doesn't mean that every character who has ever had a role in a DC movie will be in the Flash movie, but it does mean that any of them could be in the Flash movie. And now that we're hearing about multiple Batmans, Wonder Woman, Cyborg, and now Superman, a lot of people are getting very excited for what this movie might end up becoming. And it is also quickly becoming the most important movie for DC moving forward as they try to head in a new direction. Now, the most exciting development of all of this news for the Flash movie is Brandon Routh saying that there is an absolute possibility that Superman could be involved in the Flash movie. Now, Brandon Routh, if you don't remember, played Superman in 2006 Superman Returns. So, obviously, he's referring to himself when he's making this reference. We know that there's a lot of talk about Henry Cavill and his returning to DC Universe and, and being involved as the Superman that he is, but this is a separate Superman. And they've explained that through the multiverse, there is a never-ending possibility of different characters with different heights, color, gender, all of that can be mixed up and mashed in these parallel universes. So the existing of more than one of these characters, as we're going to see in this Flash movie, is going to become very apparent and very clear. That's why we're going to have both Ben Affleck and Michael Keaton be a part of this Flash movie. And now it has been rumored that Michael Keaton will make a return playing more of a Nick Fury-esque role, combining, connecting, and working to culminate all the characters together and give them their ultimate purpose. But if we get to Superman now, this is going to be a very, very crazy movie. Again, we don't know what depths all of these characters will be involved, if it will just be for a few minutes as they're running through the multiverse, or if they're all going to team up together to try to save the day. All of these possibilities are 100% an option, but now we are hearing that all of these different characters are making a comeback. DC has been making movies for a very long time. There are multiple of all of these characters, different flashes. Wonder Woman, Superman, all of these characters there are multiple of, and if DC goes as far to bring them all together and explain and expand the universe, that could be really, really cool. Especially for this one Flash movie. And then moving forward, we know the parallel universes exist, we know the universe that DC characters across the board exist in is connected, and that leaves possibilities for a very, very exciting future for this franchise. The DCEU would no longer be the main DC timeline, where everything can exist together. So it's definitely heading in a different direction, and now that an actor who played Superman in 2006 
is saying that it's an absolute possibility that his character could return and play himself in the Flash, then that means they're definitely talking to him and there is at least some type of coordination and ideas being thrown around about including this character. Who knows who else they have been talking to and trying to get involved in this DC event. The Flash movie is a very exciting movie that will be coming out and I think a lot of people are excited for The Flash himself. But go ahead and buckle down and get ready because the DC multiverse will be opening up and expanding the DCEU into the DC universe. A lot of characters are on the board to join and a lot more will probably be thrown out and on their way as well. We'll be sure to keep you up to date on all the characters who are included in the Flash movie and if you love to stay up to date on all major movie and television news, be sure to hit that like and subscribe button as we're covering it here on the channel. This has been Cosmic Culture, it's Chris, and thank you for joining.